Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today, we're diving into something fascinating and a little concerning, the sun is waking up. NASA scientists are warning that after years of relative calm, the sun's activity is increasing, and this could bring more extreme space weather in the coming decades. So, what exactly does that mean for us here on Earth? Let's break it down. The sun doesn't always behave the same way. It goes through an approximately 11-year cycle where activity rises Music and falls. When it's at its most active, we call that solar maximum or solar max. During this time, we see more sunspots, more solar flares, and more massive bursts of energy called coronal mass ejections. Think of these as giant storms on the sun, and they can have serious consequences for our planet. So why is NASA saying the sun is waking up? Well, scientists have been tracking signs of increased solar activity since around 2008. They're seeing stronger solar winds, more intense magnetic fields, and higher sunspot counts. All of this suggests that the sun is heading into a more turbulent phase than expected. But what does that mean for us? For one, satellites are at risk. Solar storms can overload their electronics, damage solar panels, or even knock them out of orbit. Communication systems like GPS and radio signals can be disrupted, causing everything from flight delays to navigation errors. Our power grids are also vulnerable, in fact, strong solar storms can induce currents and electrical lines, damaging transformers, and causing blackouts. And let's not forget astronauts and even airline passengers flying near the poles, who could face higher radiation exposure during powerful solar events. We've already seen early signs of this shift. In recent years, major solar flares have triggered spectacular auroras that were visible much further from the poles than usual. But along with the beauty of the northern lights comes the reminder that our technology is deeply connected to the sun's moods. So how are we preparing? NASA, NOAA, and other space agencies are constantly monitoring the sun with satellites and observatories. They're improving space weather forecasts, hardening power grids, and designing satellites to better withstand solar storms. While we can't stop the sun cycles, we can get better at predicting and protecting ourselves from their effects. In short, the sun is waking up, and it's bringing both wonder and risk. The good news is that we're more prepared than ever before to deal with it. But as solar activity continues to rise, it's something we'll all be keeping a close eye on. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, hit the like button, subscribe for more space updates, and let me know in the comments, what part of solar storms do you find most fascinating, the auroras, the science, or the risks to our technology?